No, you are not crazy. A couple days ago, I released a video about the Bullet Ruck. This one has the laptop. This is 16 liters, the laptop edition. Very cool. Lots of really awesome features that you would want to maybe go check out in the previous video. I also did a bullet hack that I won't rehash here because it's in the previous video. So go back and watch this one. The way you can tell you're in this video is I put the Halloween patch on there because it's almost Halloween. So that's pretty cool. But realize that there is drastic differences between all three of these bullet rucks. Well, you know, as soon as I did this one and we had all three of these on the shelf because they were all three awesome bullet rucks, different features for each. Well, they came out with a fourth one. And this time we have the Heritage Edition. So all four bullet rucks here on the table. Let's talk about the differences and really highlight everything that makes this Heritage Edition super, super cool. So putting everything aside, um, just keeping them on the table really to kind of highlight the differences between all of the bullets that we have out here from GORUCK. We have the Classic Edition. Again, I did a specific video just on this one. Got a lot of great features. Uh, the newest ones in, improve things with this 210 back, which is fantastic. No frame sheet on this one. This one's the Classic. And then this one was, you know, is sort of next. This is a, basically a Classic Plus the 16 liters so it adds a liter really in this laptop compartment but it also adds a lot of the awesome 210d back panel from a rucker configuration on the back and a laptop compartment bomb proof and a frame sheet so we got a thick frame sheet in this one and then we've done a video on this one before too but just to remind you this is the rucker version which has a really awesome plate pocket inside also has the 210 D lumbar pad stuff that you see in a rucker. So both of these on the back panel are very similar. This, this one has an internal plate pocket, which carries all the way up to the 45 pounder. This one has a laptop compartment, which does actually hold everything up to, but not including the 45 pound ruck plate. Pretty cool, you can fit everything from the tall and the short ruck plates, um, 20 and 30 pound and a little 10 pounder if you have that one. Um, will fit in here just very nicely, but you have the thinner straps. So just think about that. If you really wanted one, you could use this one, but that's just not me. And I'm gonna do a very uh, extensive heritage walkthrough of everything we know because we've got a new, a bunch of new heritage stuff that just recently came out. But this was one of those things and highlighted today is the heritage bullet ruck. This is in slate, which is also a very cool color. I've never seen this one. Um, and so I'm gonna get out all the different colors that I have. I think I have everything except two and various things, but this is pretty cool. So this thing is missing one big thing, but it adds one thing that you don't have in the rest. So let's take a look at that specifically. External features, it's a bullet rock classic. So there's no frame sheet in here. So it's, you know, packable and everything else. It's also waxed canvas, which is fantastic. And I just love the feel. In fact, for me, everything heritage is like wearing a, your favorite pair of jeans, uh, your hoodie, it's the comfort ruck it's what you feel like when you don't want to you know test anything you just go right to wax canvas that's the way i feel about it at least but anyway this is slick so it doesn't have any of the webbing in the front and again the bullets don't have any webbing on the side uh, and it doesn't have any webbing on the straps so it has the same thickness of shoulder strap like the rest no webbing so it's basically a slick basically heritage and but it has leather on the bottom so that's very cool and the leather handle accent on the top and then just again a little bit of a contrast with the stitching and the attachments of the shoulder straps everything else in the, and the, the webbing that does the shoulder straps but inside um, it's no different than the rest it's got everything that you'd expect the one coolest feature and i've just got you know speaking of hoodies some hoodies in here but what's really awesome is that we have this nice in leather like on all the heritages patch the leather go rock bullet rock built in the usa so these are all built in the usa um, no webbing on the back everything inside is just like the rest of the bullets with you know the exception of the colors and it's waxed canvas so it's just awesome um, again no frame sheet and but 
What's awesome is this top pocket, uh, which is very, very nice. And again, one of my favorite features of all the Heritages is they all have this pocket, at least the newest ones. There's a couple of legacy ones that didn't, but all of them have this top pocket, which is great because I don't want to ruck with this one with a plate, with hydration bladder. This one is the EDC, maybe some light travel kind of bag, so it's just fantastic. Sewn in, so it's just very, very nice, very packable, very cool. So again, as the top pocket, waxed canvas, just great, better EDC, I think it's fantastic. And so here's the million dollar question, why doesn't it have a laptop compartment? So that's kind of annoying because we got this one and it does have a laptop compartment. Then we got the Heritage, which is pricey, but it doesn't have that ball proof laptop compartment, which is to me kind of a miss, but I do love the packability of it. And so if you were gonna use this like that, that's I think the advantage of the original or the classic style is that without that frame sheet, it's just more packable. If you wanted to put it in another bag and take it on the road, this original Heritage bullet is exactly that too. Very packable, very usable, very user-friendly. But here's a prediction, and I could be wrong, but I predict this is the last edition of we, that we see with this, is because now we've seen bullets with laptop compartments. I would venture to bet that the next round of bullets and heritage come with that laptop compartment. I don't know. I mean, I just think that that would make this probably the best small EDC bag for a lot of people because they really want to take that laptop. And for me, if I'm going to use this for EDC, I really only travel with the, you know, the regular size iPad and that fits in the front pocket very nicely. And that's the way I kind of go sometime if I just want to carry the bullet. And now that I have this cool slate color, that's probably what's going to happen. So there you go. That is the Heritage bullet. Very awesome. Lots of cool features, very nice feel. You know, I'm a big fan of all the Heritage stuff. And again, I'm gonna do a nice little wrap up video of everything Heritage that we know and love because there's just a ton out there now. And I think people wanna see the colors and the configurations just to see them all side by side. So we'll do that soon. But in the meantime, enjoy this little video about the Heritage Bullet. One of my favorite sizes, this 15 liter really does a lot. And it also, because it's got this top pocket, it's just more useful for me. So that's me. And uh, anyway, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel. We'll see you next time. We've got a lot more coming out. It's just too much to tell you. I got a lot over there in the stack and a lot more plans. So definitely stay tuned, sign up for alerts, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next video. In the meantime, we're gonna get outside. See ya. You are definitely not crazy. There's